let's pay a visit to the Leatherman booth. So I'm here at the Leatherman booth with Brad, and we're going to be checking out a couple items. Before starting, I just want to, is it okay to say how we, how we got here? Sure. But Brad made all of this happen for us coming over here to Leatherman. We met a couple months ago at a Starbucks, and he just, uh, liked, I guess he liked the videos. and uh, your website. Liked the site, uh, showed some kind of gear and everything, and he's like, oh, are you going to SHOT Show? And I'm like, no, I, I don't think so. He's like, oh, you got to go. And I was like, well, I don't really have a, a badge or anything. Oh, you come with me. And I'm like, well, I don't really have a camera guy. I bring him along. So Brad made all of this happen. So, I mean, that's awesome. Which, I mean, I already like Leatherman as is, but now it's just a, a Leatherman. Leatherman's up there for me. So, so thanks so much for Brad. And he's going to show us uh, some of these cool items. I was asking some of the new ones for 2015. And uh, these two are the ones that we uh, check it out so the first one is the new Leatherman signal this will be available in the latter part of the year in July or August and this is a tool that's going to be great for the camper uh, for the enthusiast sport enthusiast and the prepper and what it is is a, a multi-tool with outside opening knife blade the knife blade we give you a combination blade with serrated and straight as you saw you can open it with one hand we've also included a, a saw on the tool available from the outside as well. You see right here is a hammer. The carabiner clip can be used to clip it on your backpack, on your belt loop, clip it anywhere. Also it'll open a bottle, hammer, and it'll hold a hex bit right there. So you can put your driver bits in there to drive screws if you'd like. On the inside it's very similar to most Leatherman with needle nose, pliers, wire cutters, and down on the bottom in the crotch area is the hard wire cutter. The wire cutters are replaceable, they're 154 CM steel. Then available on the inside you can see we have a screwdriver with the Leatherman driver bits. So if you slot it in a Phillips and you can switch them around, they fit right in there. They do lock in place. We also give you an awl or leather punch and a bottle opener. Now the outside portion has some cool little, little add-on type tricks to it, that, which, I, it does. which I really liked. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to pull this out of here, and that there is a ferrous rod that allows you to light a fire, but also it will, it has a built-in whistle, which is a signal whistle should you ever need to uh, signal anybody in the woods if you're in a situation where you need to get someone's attention. And then with utilizing the back side of the saw, you can drive a spark to start a fire. <laughs> That's awesome. I, I really liked how thin it was too. I mean, I, I carry the Leatherman Juice as my uh, EDC. I mean, and that's a really th thin, but it's like a full-size uh, multi-tool. So, and I just really liked all the additions to it. It's really, really cool. These are all handmade right here. These are all prototypes right now. I said that these are going to be available. This fits in. The little notch goes right into the the handle there, and then you just push down, and it keeps it clipped in. When will it be available? Latter part of the summer, July, August area. And these are all handmade prototypes. Then on the back side here, we give you a diamond sharpener, which will allow you to put an edge on your blade when you're in the woods. So if you ever need to sharpen that blade for any reason, you have it available right here, or any other tool for that matter. And this fits right on the handle. Yeah, so then that, that's the Leatherman signal then. This is the Leatherman signal. So it's designed as a full-size multi-tool and for rescuing and fire starting or for all sorts of things. Absolutely. This is a prepper's yeah, that's a, that's a tool right here. Yeah, oh, man. Uh, so now you have some, uh, some cool things on your wrist that we're going to talk about too. <laughs> I do. This is the, the, the Leatherman tread. You're, you're not in a, a biker gang or anything. That's I a, am not. That's a, <laughs> This is the Leatherman Tread. That's something else. This tool was developed by the president of our company. He was walking into Disneyland one day. He had his multi-tool in his pocket. He slipped it out of his pocket. The guard saw him and said, what have you got in your pocket? He told me he had a multi-tool and they escorted him back to his hotel room to deposit his multi-tool before he could go into the park. So while he was there in his mind, he was developing this tool right here. As a way to get into this. So you can carry a multi-tool on you at all times. As you can see here, it's a bracelet with, with multiple tools on it. We start off with a bottle opener. As you walk around, you can see square drive, 
screwdriver. We have a little wrench right there. More driver bits. And it walks around and you can mix and match these larger wrenches as you go. Wow. Oxygen bottle wrench, hex bits, Torx bit. This will work on Leatherman tools. And these are all laid out another uh, this would be for your telephone. If you have a SIM card, you can punch it out right there. We have a glass break. And this is a cutter. So how would you use some of the tools like a, a glass break to get enough leverage to do it? So you, you just uh, unwind it a little bit and then... You just fold it over and you can then just... You can see the little the mark that I made yeah. right there on the piece of paper. Cool. And that will just give you... With that glass break, you'll be able to punch it right out. So basically, is it everything that a multi-tool would have except for like blades? Then? Exactly. And then in the catalog here, we've listed everything that's available for you. So as you see, these are all the various links. Yeah. You can mix and match. You can add and subtract. If you need to fit your wrist a little bit better and take one out or yeah. put one in to expand it or contract it, you can do that. So you like if you like precision flatheads and torque or something. Exactly. exactly. Cool. You can put that. And I don't think I think we'll continue to develop more and more yeah. as we see the need. I think it's going to feel definitely a guy bracelet. <laughs> Absolutely. I, my, my wife would not, I would not wear it, but I, I can see a lot of guys digging on that. Yeah. That's really cool. And it comes in a watch version too. It does. And the watch we have listed in our catalog as well on the next page. And this is the Tread QM1. Yeah. And the bracelet features are very similar. The watch face was designed after a P51 instrument. And uh, so we have kind of a real simple, easy to read watch. Well, those numbers glow then the 9 12. They do. Okay. They, do. Cool. they glow at night. In fact, last night I used it and I wear glasses. Yeah. And at night I didn't need them to read the dial. That's cool. And uh, you can have up to 20 tools on the watch itself. Waterproof, very comfortable to wear. Makes a statement and you have all the tools available. That's definitely, definitely a trip. conversation piece, too. Absolutely. <laughs> well, cool. I think that's going to do it for the Leatherman Booth Review. So a special thanks again to Brad from Leatherman for making all this happen. Uh, none of the shot show videos that you see on my channel would happen without Brad. So it's just really awesome. So thanks a bunch. Yeah, yeah. We're having a Thank blast you. over here, too. So uh, Enjoy the check show. out Leatherman. Well, you guys already know Leatherman. So check them out again. So, all right, see you guys.